Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to get a dynamic image based on the drop-down menu. What I mean is pretty much this. I have a drop-down menu here. I make a selection and the image on top changes to whatever I uh, select. Um, you can... Um, Um, so pretty much the way you do this is by, um, let me start from the beginning. First, let's get our data validation or our drop-down menu. So let me start by Amex Gold. Mm, Sapphire and Unlimited. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to insert the images. Now, um, a very important thing is all the images gotta be the same size and they have to be lined up together. Let me show you how it works. So what I'm going to do is line up all the images together and all the images have to fit inside the cell. So this is very, very important. You create the cells, let's just say this, this size. Um, what you're going to do next is lined up the images to the cell. Now this is a very, very important step, guys, and you'll see why. So fine, we have our, our images now. Next thing you know, we're going to create a drop-down menu or data validation. In this case, you will select the cell. And you'll come to data, data validation, select the list, and the source of your list. Um, next step, you're going to take any of these images, copy, and you're going to paste anywhere, pretty much. Uh, this is where the key um what well, a key steps comes select the image name give it a name that you will remember in this case i'll give it photo the scope leave it as is comment that's up to you and this is where the magic will happen okay follow this formula equals index open parenthesis you're going to index the cells where the images are located, in this case, will be B2 to B4, comma, match, open parenthesis, you're going to match this, your um, drop down menu selection, comma, to your data here. Now you're going to close parentheses for match, close parentheses for index, and click OK. Now you're going to select the image. Equals to photo, the name you just created. Enter. What you just told us that this image is equals to the formula you enter. Now you drop down and the image change. Now the reason why I said the image must fit in the cell is for the following reason. You see this space here. This space is pretty much this empty space here. How we solve this is by making it smaller. You can align the images later on and you know do whatever you want. 
another um important thing is this this is pretty much a window or a mirror of whatever it is inside the cell that's why the image has to fit perfectly inside the cell so in case you need to change your images in the future or update them um you can just move them around no other coding necessary for example this is not the amex gold so this is the amex gold this is the amex gold this is the reserve and this is the unlimited I'll make the selection in the image displays now if you would like to do something like I do here for example when I have multiple and in other um, sheets you can do it uh, the following way for example the data that I have here is listed here so pretty much you can just follow the same steps open a new tab um, and first begin by selecting your data or your drop down menu which in this case will do the same thing the source we're gonna go back to the sh original sheet where our data is listed select and OK by doing this we have our data next step we're going to go back and select any of these images be careful not to select this image as this image is already linked to this defined name that we created earlier create one of the images that have nothing in the formula bar copy go back to the other sheet and paste anywhere you're going to do the same thing we're going to repeat the same process select the image go back to formulas define name in this case I'm gonna give it photo 2 and we're going to follow the same formula in this case equals index <clears throat> open parenthesis go back to the sheet where you have your data in this case um, B2 to B4 so B2 to B5 match we're going to match our drop down menu values comma to our original data close parenthesis for match close parenthesis for index click OK and click OK now you take this image select it equals photo to enter now this image you can move it anywhere select the different options and your image will change dynamically alright guys once again let me write down the formula or let me just go over the formula all right guys I hope this is helpful um give it a like button subscribe and share guys I will highly appreciate it thank you